The big question today is, do we let the kids win? When you're playing a game with your kids, whether it's a board game, a game of basketball, are you letting them win? Maybe sometimes you do, sometimes you don't, or are you always gonna win? And I do think it differs based on age. When Mason was around five, he would have a complete meltdown if he lost a game of sorry, and he was the worst cheater. His cheating has either gotten better or he's just gotten better at hiding it. Honestly, I just think it's a little bit of both. When he was younger, sometimes we'd let him win and sometimes we wouldn't. To, you know, work on the skill of losing. But now that he's eight, it's pretty rare if I let him win. And today his basketball team is doing a moms versus kids game. We weren't on this team last year, but last year this team did the same thing. And of course the moms won. And really no surprise, but the kids did not love that. So the question is, do we let them win or not? Because while some of us moms were dancing and cheering on the sideline in high school, some of these other moms were playing basketball and they're pretty darn good at it. And this is the same group of boys that have team sports band at recess at school because they're too competitive. And you can't help but wonder where they get that competitive nature from. Maybe they their parents. So if you're asking me, I say we beat them by 20. It'd be a good lesson of humility. A gentle reminder that us moms actually do know what we're talking about sometimes. When we say your shot's off, you're fouling too much, we're traveling. I mean, I don't know a lot about that, but other moms do. What do you think we should do? Let them win or remind them who's boss. Have a great day.